to a stupid Hey guys, a lot has changed. My hair is different. There's a stain. We're just, we don't talk about her. I am so, so excited for today's video. I am going to be reacting to my nationals footage. So for those who don't know, if you're new to the channel, I competed in America's Ideal Miss this July. I had a literal blast and I cannot wait for what's in store in pageant land. So stay tuned to find out about that. But we just got our footage back this weekend. I'm so excited. I literally just downloaded my footage today. So I haven't seen it yet. It's a blind reaction. It's just, it's gonna be so much fun. So let's do it. Also, I don't know what order these are going in because it's just like they filmed it. So let's see. Okay, so we're starting off with model search. The video's kind of weird, like it just cut to me. Okay. So this was our first competition we did at all. It was my first time walking the national stage. Okay, get a girl. Oh, fun fact, I didn't have a routine. It was such a short competition. They're like, go out, no turns, no nothing. Just walk out there, hit two poses and walk. So that's what I did. I literally came up with this routine backstage. What's next? Oh, this is talent. I don't know if this is gonna grace the internet, but we'll react. Okay. Oh, you're late. Oh. 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 Those tights are not it. Okay. Yes, power. Oh. Mm. <laughs> Get it, girl. You know what? Not bad. Not the worst thing ever, not my favorite, but we'll take it. Competitions you're about to see, so Sherry Hill, fitness, talent, and swimsuit. I was running on three hours of sleep. I literally woke up the next morning, I think my aura ring literally asked me if I wanted to record my nap. This is active wear. These are also the first times I was ever walking the stage. Like we hadn't had a rehearsal, we hadn't had anything. Active wear, I'm excited to watch. I was so glad that I was in flat shoes, but I also know I walked way too far because I had been practicing and when we got the meeting, it was like, okay, the stage is gonna be 40 feet deep and 90 feet wide. Like, oh my gosh. But they have a lot of props that they put up on the stage platforms and they have these billboards and these signs and everything, so it's different. It was so not as big as I had been thinking it was. So I had been over practicing it so I thought it was gonna be larger than it was. So I was so glad I did these optionals because it let me kind of know where I needed to stand for required. Did it grow? Okay. Okay. Yes. I love this blue. Love it. Okay. Oh, I wish I would have done my hands differently. I really need to like sit up, like stand up with my chest. Oh yes, the pan. The pan from your feet to the bottom. Oh, you can tell that this was my fun fashion machine because I just did that with my hands. Okay. Mm, get a girl. Get a girl. Slay. Yeah, I'm literally in Timbuktu. Where am I? I'm out in the middle of nowhere. Obviously, this is like, this is the cut video, but like the way it cut, it, it cut off the end of my routine, like my final turn, whatever. This is swim. This won't ever see the light of day, but I'll react to it. Story time. I get backstage for active wear, and because we have a miss, they were like, go, 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 go. I pull out my stuff, and I realize I have the wrong top. I had a sports bra that went with a skirt that was just for comfy lounging around that was the exact same color as my swimsuit, and so I grabbed my sports bra top and not my swim top. You know what? Not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Also, not only did I not have my right top, but we got out there, and usually the judges are like kind of far back. I'm trying to explain this in like, if you haven't done a pageant or don't know pageants. So usually the judges are like kind of far back. So you like can look out. Well, I'm already tall. I'm 5'10 and I'm wearing I think five inch heels. We get out there and you walk to the stage and you hit your ex. And they have it like literally marked on the floor where you're supposed to go. You hit your ex and you look out and the judges were right here. Like they were first row. So you went. So you can see I'm literally looking like this at all of them. Cause I'm trying to make eye contact, but my eyes are just straight down. So they did move them back for like prelims and finals, but that was tough. It's prelims. I remember thinking, I wish I had moved my hips more and I did when I did finals cause I did make top 16. I wish I didn't. I wish I had done the same fun fashion walk that I did for prelims. <gasps> Get it girl. Okay. Okay. This looks in the right spot here. Killing it. Yes. Jonas Brothers. We were jamming to Jonas Brothers. 
Wait, oh my god, I killed it! Oh my gosh! That's where I flashed everyone. Cute. Well, and like you can you can kind of see it. Like the slit is literally it's not flashing anyone, but when I turned it looks like I'm flashing people. There were so many layers of clothing under me though. No one was being flashed, I promise. Oh my gosh! That turned out so good. Wait. Oh, there was a misstep there. It's okay. Oh my gosh, wait, she was pretty cute. I was so proud of that. That was a custom that I kind of did. Literally bought a dress at Ross and just got it altered. I paid more to alter that than I did for all the pieces of it. This gown for prelims. Oh Lord. I was sick as a dog this day. I literally did half of my makeup, laid down in bed. My state director sitting in the corner and I fell asleep. Her daughter came in, we finished my makeup and then we were doing my hair. I was like, you know what? I'm hot, I'm overheating anyways. I don't feel good, my allergies were kicking my butt. Let's do a ponytail. I really wanted to do a ponytail, let's do a ponytail. So I have a ponytail in this, so I don't love it as much because I probably should not have done a ponytail, but it's okay. Also, I changed this routine the night before I competed it. Changed it the night before I competed this routine because I had a turn in my old routine. I was like, I'm really worried about this. It's just really scare me changed it changed it music so fast so fast night before i learned this routine before i competed Kill girl. <gasps> oh my gosh okay she's a little shaky but that's okay <gasps> get it girl okay Oh my gosh, get it girl. You got this. Oh, this turned out so good. Those little hands. Oh, scan. She had it. Oh, I can hear my team in the background screaming. Oh my gosh. That's so exciting. Okay, this is optional crowning. I won third runner up for talent. I'm literally double this girl size. Okay, this is finals. So this is, I think it's like the top 16, which, okay, you can literally see it in this video too. I'm out in Timbuktu. Like, I'm so far away from these girls. And it looks weird when you're looking at it from like the side profile, but there's literally a video board. And so I had to stand between two video boards because if I stood right next to the other girl, you wouldn't be able to see me. You can see all of us going with our feet. We were in so much pain. I was so shocked. I had no idea I was going to get this. I'm literally walking like, what? Congratulations, Texas. You are our B ideal winner. Oh this is when I got called for top 16. Oh my gosh. Wait, did I almost just fall? Okay, this was final sight, and that's why I wish if I was trying to do my hips so much that I didn't focus on like my shoulders up and back so you can already see it. We have Megan Trainer. We have great final sight song. Very excited to like exit out for copyright. But it's literally a mashup of No and Boss, and it was great. And my dress didn't like flash anyone. Lift, lift, lift your head. Slay. I glam this night, slay. Such a slay. It. I just went. Who is she? I need to scan. I'm done to scan the room. Yeah, I popped my head too much. Slay. This is final night for gown. Oh. Our song, it's literally I'm walking down. It's falling in love with you. This gown was gorgeous. I could cry. This gown was so gorgeous. Oh, you can see it in the video. It was too big in the chest. Like it was just it fit weird that the straps so I was worried about like it not touching the floor and so I had pulled it down to make sure it touched the floor and it was kind of bad because then I was kicking over it. You can't really tell but I was kicking it and so I was like I almost tripped over it and then the top I should have like used it that way because it's like barely gaping right here. You can see it in the video. And that's it because I didn't make top five.
I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If it isn't up already, which it might not be, my nationals vlogs will go live. I did the whole thing. I vlogged the prep of it, the packing, and the actual week itself. It was kind of difficult to vlog the week of because I was there by myself for a portion of it. So I did realize also just how much like we were jumbled, jam packed. Oh, I'm so excited. That was my first nationals in the books. It was crazy because the hotel and the venue were two separate places. I was absolutely insane for that reason. Literally so excited. I had a blast. I had the time of my life. My gown was gorgeous. I literally, she's hanging up off camera, but I just love that gown. I adore it. I think it was the perfect color. It felt like Cinderella. I loved working with Sydney's closet on that gown. I will link their information below. If you haven't checked out Sydney's closet, you definitely should. So, so excited. Can't wait to share what's in store for pageant land next. I will get to keep my title until the next Texas pageant, and then I will get to crown my successor, and it will be my farewell, and I'm so excited for that. I will vlog it all and take you along. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you have any content ideas for me, let me know in the comments below, or you can always DM me. If you want to see my journey as America's Ideal Miss Texas throughout the rest of my reign, follow me at Ideal Miss underscore TX. That is my official title holder page if you're just wanting to see what's going on in my life, and also get some of the lovely pageant content. You can find my socials linked below. I may pop them up on the screen somewhere around here, and I cannot wait to share. I have podcast episodes that are literally filmed. They're ready to go. I just have to edit them, and then I will get those posted. I can't wait to show you who are the special guests coming on. Absolutely love it. I am just so excited. As much as I love nationals, I'm glad life is kind of slowing down a bit, and I can put more of my love into my craft of creating. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!